Um, We've been talking about what it was doing but the grand master of football vernacular has to be that linguistic legend, Jack Dyer, whose column in the Truth newspaper had the appropriate name, Diarrhea. About two weeks. <laughs> As Tiger's coach, he once told his players to pair off into threes. As a commentator, he described Justin Madden's arms as two giant testicles. And as an interviewer, he was a hell of a player. Because Jack used to have this interviewing <laughs> technique of saying uh, the new kid had come on and, uh, and Jack would say, oh, where are you from, Corowa? Oh, yeah. How heavy are you? Oh, 12 and a half stone. How tall are you? Oh, six feet two. Well, he said, you are a tall boy. You know, that, that, Jack, that was Jack's opening gambit with most of them, you know. Yeah, he used to... He'd, he, or he'd say, and what's your height and weight and how tall are you? That was another one. He... <laughs> a young fellow had come in for his first game, sit down and Jack would say, how big are you? How tall are you? How old are you? What school do you go to, son? And the same questions. And... Uh, you're tough. You reckon you'll be able to keep up with these boys today? The same questions, but they were beautiful questions. No, it's not right at all. We didn't chew ducks. You're, right. you're wrapped in the Hawthorne side. Apparently you're wrapped. Darkie Nelda and Brendan Edwards. Do you think Brendan's back in town again? Too right. What about John Peck? Is he your favourite? Pecky? Oh, yes, he's running them. And what do you think about the umpire? I think you'd have a word to say oh. about him. <laughs> Shocking. He's shocked. Jack McMurray, it's nice to have you here. Thank you, I, have, John. I have your record in front of me here, and what you've missed out on doing, well, it's not worth mentioning here, as a matter of fact. Uh, I can't go through it because it would take me all day. Yes, I'll get you. And you did a lot of, did a lot of miles too, didn't you, Jack? Yeah, listen, you're on my deaf side, and I can't even have the other one. I knew I'd make a mistake. I knew I would. Listen, I'm McIntosh. Yeah, he could fight um, too. Uh, who said so? I did. <laughs> Watson. Yes. I played against him, so be careful. I oh, beg your pardon. Well, now, don't tell anything you shouldn't tell about Colin Watson because I played against him. Next great one, thing. this was a great footballer too. Was I? Ivor Ward Smith was one of the best footballers along. How do you know I was going to say that? <laughs> All right, go ahead. Listen, you'll go out for a fortnight, like <laughs> <that> silly conduct. <laughs> you always said seven weeks when I was playing. Did you that play? Who did you play with? <laughs> and I was waiting for you to report me, but you never. I you told you I should have deported. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pair of jacks, a full hand, or a handful. Ah, oh, thank you, a card. There's more magic moments coming your way. A flame and good score. Nice flip pass, EJ. Keep swinging with Kevin and that bloke with the name. Ah, footy and seven. It won't be the same. Solving.